I've literally just realized that this video that you're currently watching is going to be the last vlog that I ever post that I ever film whilst being a dad of one. Like the next vlog that I film, I'm going to have two daughters. And that is so wild to think. I don't know why it's wild to think about. It just feels feels like a big difference. If you watched my vlog last week, then you'll know that Zoe and I are in like absolute prep mode with the house of just trying to prepare everything possible, change around our daughter's rooms, order and wrap everyone's Christmas presents, just everything we can possibly do for basically the rest of the year we're trying to do in the next couple of weeks before number two is born. And in the last vlog, I was like, guys, I'm just so in the thick of it. Like, I explained it as like, you know, when you're switching around your bedroom when you're a teenager and you get like in the thick of it and it almost has to get more messy before it gets tidy again. We were there. We were like thick in that point when I was last filming to the point where every day this week I was like, ah, oh, I might vlog the day. And then very quickly realized that that's not the best idea and I just need to crack on with, with the list of stuff. Anyways, happy Saturday. Hope you're having a lovely day, whatever you're up to. We've still got a long way to go before we're like fully prepped and ready, if there's if there's even such thing as that. But the list of like things that we've put on our to-do list, we've like set to-do list to do every single day. The things to do today are like pretty nice chill things. Like we've got to decorate the tree in Otty's playroom with her. We're gonna put some like garlands and decorate the stairs. We've got to sort a bunch of stuff out that we're dropping off to a local charity. There's just lots of little bits. It's like a chill day today. It's a Saturday. Otty woke up with more energy this morning than I think it's human to even have. Like I don't understand how she just woke up with so much energy. As soon as her eyes opened, all she wanted to do was run downstairs and play with her toys. And I tried everything possible to be like, come on, let's just come and get into our bed for a bit. Why don't we have breakfast in bed this morning? I'll bring it up to bed. And she wasn't having it at all. So I've been downstairs playing every different game that she's got in her playroom, listening to every different song of kids music. I feel like I've already been awake for an entire day and it's currently like 9 a.m. or something. <laughs> Zoe's currently <laughs> making breakfast. <laughs> And I was like, I need to vlog this because I feel like there's other people out there that will be the same. We're discussing our favourite utensils to use in the kitchen. If you were stirring beans mm -hmm. in a pot... What do you use? Well, I just really like this tiny little spoon. <laughs> I just... I love that for like the little pot and the little beans. But see, he's not flat. I like the one with the flat on the top. But this isn't your favourite one. No, he's too big. I would never use that. Yours is in the dishwasher. Okay, you show, <laughs> you show me what I use or what you think I use. This is your favourite. <laughs> this is your favourite. That's favorite. my boy. That's the one. The grey spatula. It's absolutely The grey spatula. I want to buy three more of them because I use him so much and then put it in the dishwasher and then get so upset when he's not there. You use it for everything too. Everything. Does everyone have a favorite hob? <laughs> oh yeah, this is very important. I'm saying that's the, that's the only option. Oh, right. There is no other option I'd ever do unless I was cooking more than one hob at a time. Yeah, top right. But because these are on here and it's only a small saucepan. I'm See, I would sure. still move everything off, put him top right no. and just have a low flame. Not for beans. I'm committed. In the comments down below, what hob positioning are you going for? Also, please tell me I'm not alone in the fact that I've lived in this house. How many years? Next Seven year? years. 2017 to 20, almost 2024. I still turn the wrong ones on. It doesn't tell you on these. So I still will turn one and be like, oh, wrong one. I get the top and the bottom wrong every time. Right's the top, left's the bottom. Well, you'd think by now I would know, but I still do it wrong. Also, we've had the most random breakfast. We've had a, a we've had a yogurt like each. Yeah, but it's only ten o'clock. It's not even ten. It's just so like I need to just keep eating. <laughs> I just said to the vlog a second ago, this is my last ever vlog as a dad of one. Well, two including Nala, but yeah, one, one, one child. child. <laughs> yeah, how crazy is that? Mine will probably be too. I think I might shoot like a little Q&A about what I'm hoping being a dad of two is going to be like. I might shoot that and upload it next week. You never know. If the baby comes early, baby comes early. This is the last vlog where it's like guaranteed, going to go up, safe zone. 
Yeah. Past today, it's kind of like, if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Also, the lighting is horrible right now. Let it's, me get, oh, God, so oh there we go. Let me get a bit of yellow light in there. It was quarter to seven and I was like, it's 4 a.m. And I looked at my phone and I was like, it's And I was downstairs singing, row, 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 you boat, Yeah. What are we going to do? Get the light out. Get the Christmas lights out? Yeah. What are we going to do with them? Decorated on. Put the decorations on. Where are we going to do it? Which room? In my room. In your playroom? Yeah. Okay. I, I just... I just need to finish making my coffee. Can I come in one minute? Okay, I'll see you in there. Wait for you. You're gonna wait for me. Yeah. All right, I got my coffee now. Let's go. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. <laughs> you may feel, as you see things in the vlog today in the house, that we are just a bit too keen with Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> That we're just a bit oh. too keen with Christmas this year. However, like I just said earlier on at the start of the vlog, we're just trying to get everything we possibly can done in advance, basically into the end of the year. So we may have our trees up. We've already got three trees up in the house, not including the real one that we are gonna get. Are you just making all the mess you possibly can? Yeah. Perfect. That's fantastic. Just keep going. Keep going. Nice. Halloween party. Your Halloween. <laughs> Is it still Halloween now? Halloween. Exactly. Anything we possibly can get done in advance so that when the little one's here, we can literally chill as much as possible and soak up any time we can to sleep. Also, because we are still really hosting Christmas this year. I'm not for able to do quite a few people. Like, in the same way? No, you won't have the same energy. It is go time. Although saying that, we are nearly done decorating. We've just got Otty's playroom here, the real tree, and the stairs. And then other than that, we've done everything already. What's in here? Decoration. Decoration? Oh my goodness. Hi, oh, little mouse. He's got his own Christmas tree. That's cute, isn't it? That is really cute. I feel like we should let Otty decide where every decoration goes. Yeah. And we just have to leave it. We can't get involved. What's that? Oh, is that Father Christmas? Is it like a reindeer? What is it? Is it his reindeer? Yeah. We did put this through the tree last year. Like I think there. Father Christmas is over here. Look, he's there. Okay. What does Father Christmas say? Do you remember? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh is he going to ride his reindeer? I think he's a little bit big. He can try. Oh. He'll be. Sorry, reindeer. Sorry. <laughs> oh, dear, you're so cute. You say sorry to everything. Well done. What do you think of your tree? It's really good. It's really, it's really good. Really Is the big man going to like it? Yeah. Where's he going to come down? Where's Father Christmas going to come? Down the chimney. Yeah, down the chimney. A minute ago she said, Father Christmas is going to fall down the chimney and what did she yeah. say? And, and then say, she said, that's say, a good tree. say, that's a really good tree. That's a really and good tree. And then leave lots of presents. I don't know where the foliage is for up here. I might have put it in one of those three boxes. I've seen it. It's in the other room. In There's like a long them, thin box. There? Yeah. I think one of them I put up here. And whose is this one? Mum. Yeah! Woohoo! Yeah. What's inside that? Oh, that's it. That's it. 
I've done it. I've done it. She worked it out. Can you put it on there for me? Uh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Good job. And this one? Can you pop him on there? Okay. Push. Good job. Can you pop that one in here? Okay. Oh, push. Oh, she's actually very good at this. One. Look at that. <laughs> Look. Oh, well done. Oh. Nice. And can you do that one? Okay. That one over here. Bombay. If any construction companies out there need an apprentice, give it a couple of years. Yeah, I stand on it. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Oh, it's exciting. Yeah. Oh, those things are so tight. Yeah, yeah, this is the bit I struggled with with her pen. That my pen. I think it's gonna be even. That really loud. That was really loud. I'm just gonna move it back a little bit. Oh, what have you got for sale? I got Christmas eating. Oh, you Christmas got Christmas eating. presents. Can I uh, have a horse, please? Um, a little rocking horse. Okay. There we go. Oh, thank you. So, how much was that? Do you want some money, Daddy? How much? Ten. Ten pounds. Jeez, that's a lot. Here we go. Ten. Oh, oh, I know what this is well. Thank you. We've got a rocking horse and a little baby. Rocking? Come on. You're welcome. <laughs> right. That is so cute. Just need to fix that leg that I just snapped. What do you like, Muffy? Can I have the star, please? Thank you so much. Oh, and this is what I get free. You get a free little baby every purchase as well. Thank you so much. Mummy hasn't paid. How much will that cost? Ten teen. Thank you. Oh, ten. oh that's my change. <laughs> <laughs> that's a great deal. Oh, mine? oh, sorry, which one's yours? Oh, yeah. Money, you can't one. steal it. Oh, she just dropped it. Bye, Ottie. Thanks so much. Bye. Have a very Merry Christmas. Mm. Bye. What I have. Do you, want, you... do you want Mummy to be the shopkeeper now? Yeah. Okay, you come out then. <laughs> How many? How are you today, madam? Great. You're great. What would you like to buy from my shop? Mm, the cookies, the box of cookies. Okay, here you go. And I'm going to give you this one as well. And thank you very much. Oops. There you go. Thank you very much. And here's your change. Thank you. Thank you. Come again. Have a lovely day. Good morning, good morning, how are we? Happy Sunday. It's currently the following day. If you can't already tell, we are obsessed with making smoothies every morning at the moment in the house. I feel like it's just the perfect thing to get us all going, get us all energized. Also, it's really fun to make. Also, it's really simple to make. And as well as that, it just tastes great as well. It's been an exciting morning this morning. The brand new the last of the year Future Self clothing collection, the Hibernate collection. Named that because it is just the most cosy, most comfortable tracksuits to just chill and relax and hibernate in for the winter. Have just gone live on the website, like literally 26 minutes ago, they went live on the website. So I've been on my laptop this morning, putting the website live, taking passwords off, putting it on Instagram stories, doing all of that kind of stuff. So as you're watching this now, the full collection is available on the website. I'll put a link down below. FutureSelfShop.com If you want to buy the most cosy, the most comfortable tracksuit you've ever worn, or maybe it's a Christmas present for somebody else. Maybe your brother or your sister likes wearing cosy tracksuits and you pick them one up for Christmas. It is now available on the website. So definitely go check it out. Cheers, guys. It has been a good couple of hours since I last picked up the vlog camera. As I said earlier, it's currently Sunday for me. And every Sunday, I love to just spend the morning basically doing as many fun things. Ignore the fact as well that I'm in a vest. I've literally just taken my jumper off and put the fire on. Yeah, as many fun things as possible with Otty. So we've been out 
playing football this morning. I went to the bakery and bought some little cakes and stuff. Also went to the coffee shop and got a little coffee. She got a juice, a little blueberry muffin. We've had a bunch of fun, but it is a good few hours later. She's currently napping. And I need to build this. So I just thought I'd shoot a little time lapse of me putting it together. This is called a snooze pod. Snooze pod, snooze pod. It's basically like a little cot that looks like this here. And it goes next to your bed. I'm pretty sure it goes like flush level. And therefore when your baby's sleeping, you can easily like have them sleeping next to you, but safely and then equally. Zoe can breastfeed her and then I can pop her back to sleep in here. So let's build, let's build this. So I say let's, it'd be good if you could help me out, but you can't, you're just gonna watch. It's kind of a team effort, although I think you've got, I think you've got a little bit of an easier job. He's only gone and done it. It's finally Yay. ready. It's finished. Ready it looks so good, looks. yeah. It's a really nice one, isn't it? I love the look of it. It's lovely. And then it just slots in like that. Oh, oh, Ottie thinks it's hers. <laughs> is this for baby? I kind of think it is for you. You know she's going to want to get it. We can try you in it, but I think you might be a bit too big. Is this for the baby? I don't think it is. Careful. Okay, no, no. You sleep down there and then baby sleep up here, yeah? I don't or... know. <laughs> is it gonna... Um... <laughs> no night. Sleepy time. Give her a little rock, Daddy. No night. Aww. Sleepies. Night night, Otty. <gasps> she's asleep. Look, if she's really asleep, apparently if you put her hand up in the air, it will stay there if she's asleep. Oh. <gasps> She's so asleep. I think the eyes open are a bit of a giveaway as well. Right. <laughs> 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 are you pretending? Oh no, she's asleep. I feel like this baby's going to come along and Otty's going to think she's a baby. <laughs> Is that a thing? Does this, ha does this happen? <laughs> Yeah, you know when you're like, oh, the second one will learn really quickly from the first one. I feel like it's no, going to be gonna the other be way awesome. around. Hello. Hello. Otty's going to regress. She's going to be like, I'm a baby too. <laughs> are you a big baby? No, I'm not a baby. No. What are you then? I'm just Otty. I'm are just Otty. And we're back where I started off the vlog. Oh, I haven't got you on a little tripod. I've just got you balanced in there. We're back where we started off the vlog yesterday. The thought of this being like... My last vlog before having a little break whilst being off with the baby, but also it's syncing up with like December time going into January, is like realistically this is not only my last video before, or my last vlog, shall I say, because I'm keen to shoot like a really relaxed Q&A before the baby comes, but that also means that this would be the last vlog of the year, which is weird to think about, like the thought of saying like, I'll see you next year. I haven't even thought about it being like a new year. I've just been thinking new addition to the family and then celebrating Christmas with the family. I haven't even thought about the new year. It feels too far away to be thinking about that. But the reality is, yeah, I won't be posting a vlog now until the new year. However, Zoe is gonna film one last video. And I know that in my last vlog, I said, oh, let me show you Otty's new room because Otty's moved into her new bedroom. And then also show you the new wallpaper and paint and everything we've switched up in the nursery. And then I never did. I completely forgot and I had so many comments on the last video. So apologies, I said I'd do it. And then I forgot and never did. I also haven't shown you in this video. However, Zoe is gonna vlog, I think a couple of days this week coming and then upload at some point this week. And she's gonna show you both Otty's new room, which is honestly so lovely. Like I'm absolutely obsessed with her new room and I think everything we've done to it looks so good and she loves it, which is obviously the most important thing. But also the nursery as well, which is, equally exciting and I love the wallpaper I love the paint that we've done there and it's super different to what to what Otty had in there so for those of you that commented on my last video you will be seeing the two rooms just over on Zoe's channel at some point this week it is coming it'll be a good one but yeah if you're still watching this video I massively appreciate it you're probably like 22 23 minutes into the vlog so it means a lot in a couple of videos recently I've been saying if you're still watching all the way to the end drop a comment down below saying big love and definitely do that. I'd love to know who's still watching this vlog. Go drop a comment now saying big love. 
But I also just thought, as I was literally putting the camera down a second ago, I'm going to set up a, just as like a random little thank you and to celebrate the new Hibernate collection that I've been wearing, I'm going to set up a discount code that I'm only going to share in this vlog here. And the code is going to be big love. So if you use that discount code on the Future Self Shop website at any point over the next like, I don't know, should I set up for like a week? Any point over the next week, then you'll get 10% off the entire website. So not just the new collection, any pieces at all, 10% off the entire website just as a thank you to those of you that not only watch these vlogs, but also watch all the way into the end. And trust me, that makes such a difference. Like to carve out 20 minutes, 25 minutes, 30 minutes, sometimes the vlogs are even like 35, 40 minutes of your day to watch these means so incredibly much. Feel free to go do, do some Christmas shopping. I need to end off the video. I need to go cook off, get up some dinner. I will see you probably in like a week or so with a Q&A. If you've got any questions that you want me to answer in the Q&A, feel free to drop them down below. I'm also gonna jump on Instagram and ask over there as well. Hope you're having a lovely day, whatever you've been up to. I appreciate you watching. I'll see you soon.